Hello and welcome to the spring semester's first edition of the Cal TV Sports Highlight. I'm your host Vince Tenura and I'm here at Haas Pavilion, the home of Bears basketball. Coming into Thursday night's game against number 15 Oregon, the Bears were losers of six straight and dropping fast in the Pac-10 standings. The prospects of getting that elusive win seemed bleak against an Oregon squad that had handed Cal its first of the six losses. Not exactly a fortuitous start for the Bears, they just could not get their offense going over the game's first 10 minutes, as Theo Robertson throws the ball away and Oregon converts it into a layup on the other end. The Ducks were clicking on all cylinders as Tawan Porter hits the jumper and then Adam Zahn gets the easy inside bucket. But Oregon gets a little three happy and suddenly goes cold, just two for 17 from beyond the arc in the first. That opens the door for young Patrick Christopher to heat up. The freshman was stupid good in the first half, stepping up and knocking down the three and then slamming it home on the sweet inside look from Robertson. Christopher again, he misses the layup but gets his own rebound and makes it a two-point game. He had 13 in the first half. Then it's freshman Ryan Anderson with a tough bank shot to tie it at 27. So the Bears now on top 33 to 27, and Jerome Randall, another freshman, hits the crazy off-balance shot to close out a 17 to nothing run at the end of the first half. In the second half, Oregon's Porter and Aaron Brooks start to heat up. As Porter hits back-to-back -back threes to knot it at 37, and Brooks uses that quickness to beat Christopher to the hole. The Bears staying with them though, and it's Randall with another ankle breaking move to cut the lead to three. But once again, it's Brooks, and shortly after his partner in crime, Porter, draining threes to go up by seven. But Cal, just hanging around, gets a swooping layup from Robertson, and later Robertson finds Christopher in the corner with a huge three ball, and we're tied at 57. The score now tied at 59, the Bears get a stop but can't get the board and Oregon goes back on top with inside of five minutes remaining. Same score with a minute left, Ayende Obaka penetrates and throws a dime to Anderson for a three point play opportunity. Anderson knocks down the free throw to put the Bears on top with a minute left. The score now 63 to 61 after an Obaka free throw, Oregon with another shot to tie it but Bryce Taylor gets hung up at the rim and Alex Pribble is fouled for the Bears. So Pribble with the chance to ice it, but he misses the front end of one and one free throws. So the Ducks still alive, but Taylor throws up an air ball, which apparently are contagious, because Chamberlain Oguchi suffers the same fate, and the Bears somehow hang on to upset the Ducks 63 to 61. After the big win, the Bears were relieved to be able to put their losing streak behind them. I mean that's a gigantic win. We you know we need this kind of upset. You know, so we can go on our own streak, like Pat said. And, uh, the good news about getting it into Ryan is he's got a pretty good pair of hands. And so the chances are when you get the ball in his hands, he's, he's catching. And, uh, boy, he finished strong. Well, they, they did play well. And they, they made some big plays. And uh, I thought Ben did a good job of bringing Anderson out of the game with his fouls in the first half. And, you know, they, Abaka made some great plays down the stretch from as well, too. So, you know, with the emotion of playing in this building, I thought they, they made plays down the stretch, and we had them there to make as well, too, and we did not make those plays down the stretch like we did earlier on in the year. Hopefully, I mean, they gave us a losing streak. I mean, you know, I hope they give us a winning streak right now. We need to win games. So that's all for this opening edition of the Cal TV Sports Highlight. Stay tuned for weekly sports updates on the Cal TV Show. Reporting for Cal TV, I'm Vince Tenura saying so long.